Hey buds, welcome back to Madables and welcome back to our DBZ movie marathon. But it's the last one until we have episode 30 and then we have another movie after that. Thank you to the guy that shared the list, the, the DBZA watch list. I'm, I'm following the list, I, I promise I'm, I'm watching it. But we have this movie which is 30 minutes long and then we have the Frieza fight and then we're and then we're back into our normal groove. We're all caught up, all right? Let's get into it. Hi, how's it going? Check out that thing, greatly appreciate it. I am I was, I was not expecting it's gonna take me more time to record this one video than the rest of my videos of the week combined so it's we're in for we're in for a treat today let's see is everything good I, I feel like I'm a little out of whack I don't know every time I record on Mondays I'm, I feel like I've never done YouTube a day in my life all right well let's enjoy this base parody uh, I may all right stand by I don't have a living room yet so I play <laughs> I play uh, my shows for dinner and breakfast out of the sh uh, out of the speakers of my monitor. Um, <laughs> my girlfriend, <laughs> my girlfriend, she she sits uh, she uses this table, so uh, it's, it's it's a little it, until we get our house all uh, all uh, fur furnished up. We're, that's what we're doing. <laughs> Dragon Ball, Dragon Ball Z, and Dragon Ball GT are all owned by Funimation, Toei Animation, Fuji TV, and Akira Toriyama. Please support the official release. Oh, that was, that was delightful. <laughs> Did he erase the shadow? Good. Progress on my ice castle is underway. I'll have to install central heating. I forgot it was on a bridge series for a second. I'm like, oh my god, he's working on some kind of ability. He's like, my ice castle is all the stuff. Like, oh yeah, that's right. Body is 90% water, and this cloak does nothing! Well, maybe you should have packed more. You never said we were going to the Sudamai Subari Mountains, literally the coldest place on earth. You just told me, hey Gohan, I stole... Found. Found the Dragon Radar. Wanna go make a wish? How oh, about a little less whining and a little more climbing? They just found the sixth ball. I love that Oolong's mainly in the movies. Kind of seems wrong that we're planning on stealing a wish. Which reminds me, what are you planning to wish for? Bulma. Where did you get those images from? Justice. What? Oh panties. Gonna wish for panties. Oh, Oolong, you're incorrigible. Yeah, yeah, just get the lot out before they find the seventh. Oh, oink me in the Alps. Rise, eternal dragon! Did I do it right? I hope I did it right. Oh, shit. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit! Is that bad? Can they break? Can they break? Can you guys let me know if Dragon Balls can break? Now I need to know if you can make like a construction vehicle out of them and take down like a giant thing made out of diamonds, except it's Dragon Balls, except you can still much rather use the Dragon Balls to summon a wish to... for anything. It's, it still blows my mind, like, it still blows my mind that there hasn't been, like, a massive change. No one's used these Dragon Balls for anything, well, I mean, bringing the forest back, I think, was pretty cool. And then bringing somebody's life back, but I feel like they shouldn't have brought back lives. You know, why wouldn't you just make Krillin the strongest character in the universe or something like that to be able to defeat Freezer? I, I, you, you know what I mean? Like, we, we, we have multiple chances to get back... The people that died. There are, we know exactly where they are. We just need to wait a little bit longer. Take care of the threat first. I'm ranting. <sighs> okay, what do you assholes want this time? Oh. Oh. Hmm. I am the Eternal Dragon. State your wish and I shall grant it. I have scoured the planet for you for the last 50 years. With you lies my only hope. Eternal Dragon, I beseech you with your bountiful mystic power. Oh no. Could you please melt the ice off my front door? I excuse me? 
Look, I left to get groceries 50 years ago. Bit of a trek to civilization. Came back, the entire lair was iced over. Went back, got some salt. Pretty evidential real quick that that wasn't going to work. If I was the dragon, I would just hide the last Dragon Ball in my body. I would I would keep it in my my mouth or something. I would I would make sure no one I could ask for any more stupid shit. Tried fire, melted it. That just made more ice. Try and figure that out. Then I tried. Uh, I'm sorry. Is this a little unorthodox? Just a little, yes. I'm sorry. I'm not really used to the whole magical dragon thing. I'm an engineer by trade. Hey, look, it's fine. But how about just throwing it out there? I give you the power to melt the ice. But that's what I have you for. Yes, I know, but I'm trying to. Don't you go pawning this off on me. I'm not, but if it happens again, then... You know, fine, whatever. Wow, that was fast. Yeah, well, I just put a massive hole in your ozone layer. What, took you 50 years to find me? Good luck figuring out how long it takes that to fix. Genron out. Oh my fucking Finally! Now, to reunite with my master and... Oh, crap. I leave my keys at slumps. Did he re... He really used the dragon to just break the ice. No way! There's no way! Even that, like... It... You could have asked for just a better ship, a better so like a better factory, like anything. All right. I know that in the abridged series, they make stupid wishes. I think they still make stupid wishes in the real show. All right. Whatever he's trying to accomplish in here, which I'm sure we'll find out a variation of, you could have wished for a significantly better version. That's the name of the movie, The World's Strongest. All right, what the hell is this, and why did my wish get wasted on it? It looks like an evil layer. Oh, no, no, uh-uh, no way. I know how this goes. You can't make me... Damn it all! Don't worry, Oolong. I'll save you. Get him, Gohan! <laughs> Oh my god. Hey, oh Gohan. God. Cold enough for you? Mr. Piccolo? Did we miss some Cybermen? Where are Fireman? I feel like we missed some Cybermen. Mr. Piccolo. Just watch out for the explody ones. Don't want to pull up. Hey, guys. I was in the middle of trading and I saw what went down. <laughs> that. Don't want to pull up that. So, wanna help me build my ice castle? Mr. Piccolo. <laughs> what is this movie? <laughs> it, doesn't, it doesn't make any sense. It doesn't make any sense. <laughs> uh, uh, oh. Mr. Piccolo? Oh, um. Mr. Piccolo's in trouble! Oh no, I'm fine, Gohan. Thanks for asking. You were sorry, but he was screaming pretty loud and- When's the uh, last time you saw a fight where someone didn't scream? Now, we are going to go home and you are not going to tell your mother about this little outing. But I, I think I love Gohan with this little haircut. It's a little random, but every time I see him with it, I'm like, you know what? I like it a lot. I Do not tell your mother about this! Okay, fine. Why do I feel like I'm going to hear that for the rest of my life? Because you are. You're seriously not going to talk to him? Why? He came back safe and sound. He was gone for three days and refuses to tell us where he went or what he did. Oh, come on, Chi-Chi. I lived in the woods for eight years all by myself. That's why you're not his role model. Of course not. Piccolo is. And that is a conversation <laughs> we desperately need to have. <sighs> Ha <laughs> ha!
<laughs> I sure hope Mr. Piccolo's doing all right. Wait, where are we now? Oh, they just went, they went back, okay. Go on, go on! I'm trying to reach you telepathically. God, go on, they've captured me! Go on, they're torturing me! They're forcing things into my brain, go on! Go on, my veins! Go on, my veins! Go on! Gohan, what is going on with you? I... I was dreaming. Well, have you finished your homework? Oh, Mom, I've never finished. That is the correct answer. Gohan, you're not on drugs, right? It was just the one apple, Mom. This is some old bullshit. What does just that because mean? I stole the dragon radar means I have to do all the prep work? Where does he even grow this stuff anyway? He doesn't have a basement. Best not to yeah. ask too many questions. Where is... I thought Master Roshi was in the show more. Because I'm like, this kind of looks like his house a little bit. But like... I, for some reason, I thought he was a bigger part of the show. Also, have you checked the oven? Oh, hell! <laughs> Great, now my entire evening is going to be spent trying to find something to watch on Netflix. Who's better not be my brownie, pig? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, jeez, turtle, can you get that? I cannot find my feet. What up? You got the money? We want the Roche. And we want the money. Bring us the Roche or be destroyed. How about you get the hell off our island? There are six of Bioman and one of Turtle. I am 999 years old. I don't give a f. <laughs> Aspire to be him. Yeah, you the buyer? Because <laughs> there's going to be a bit of a delay. <laughs> Turns out, pigs can't cook brownies. You have been forcefully invited to the laboratory of Dr. Willow. I only need one doctor, and that's feel good. Also, my GP to check my prostate every few years is important to my age. Roshi, what the heck is going on? Wait, are those Cybermen? Dude, what is Bulma doing here? She could be anywhere, all right? She can make lots of things. She can make me do anything. She can, she can control the world, all right? I, what is she doing on this little island? I think she's more than capable to go explore space at this point. We are firemen, and if you do not comply, we will make you. Oh, it is a bad time for this. You better come back. Nice. I do not hold back when I'm toasted. Excellent. Exactly to be expected from the world's strongest fighter. I'm not one to brag. <laughs> Dr. Wheelow will be humbled to have you as his honored guest, whether you like it or not. Are the body is not a clear indicator of how this is gonna go down. Well, you see, strength is only relative when a little leverage is applied. <laughs> now comply, lest I have my cyber. We are biomass. Yeah. Yes, whatever, <laughs> nobody cares. My creations rip her limb from limb. Damn it, those are some fine ass limbs, too. All right, I'll go. Turtle, you're in charge. All right, but if the buyer shows up, I'm taking 10%. Traffin' ass turtle. <laughs> oh, man, Roshi might have been kidnapped. Oh, don't sweat it. Roshi can handle that. Yeah, they might have also been strong enough to take Piccolo, too. Oh, they said they were looking for the world's strongest fighter. But I'm... Why didn't they... There's been a terrible mistake. I gotta fix this. There he is. Your new body. Why is he old? He's the world's strongest man. And the world's oldest. Again, Cochin, why not just give me the woman? I told you, you can't have a woman's body. They're not nearly strong enough. Uh, sexism aside, I'm really not that picky. Also, she doesn't have a penis. So you want to give me the old man? Yes. With the old man's penis? Listen, you just need a demonstration. <laughs> oh, please, no. Oh, come on, this ain't your first kidnapping. <laughs> Feast your eyes on our bio warriors! Cochin! 
What did you do to my creations? Sansa! Blub blub! Burr! I made a few alterations this morning. Introducing Electrocutioner, Bouncy Butcher, and Freezer! Bah! Fighting someone on the trademark. For that last name, though. Okay. They're terrifying! I was, I was gonna Terrifyingly say. effective! They were supposed to be cute and cuddly and ain't the elderly! But do now they're cruel and... <laughs> you know, for a second I thought this picture... I thought that was legit in the show. I, I didn't think that... Well, I mean, I guess it could be. But, like, why would they use this image on that giant sky? I feel like it's just a cutout that the editors made, but... It... You know what? I could see it going either way. I didn't think about it because I keep forgetting this is an abridged series, but like. <laughs> I just thought it was funny. Supposed to be cute and cuddly and ain't the elderly. Now they're cruel and vicious and fight the elderly. Speaking of which, commence the demonstration. Oh man, and I'm coming down. <laughs> Whoa, where'd she come from? And why is she chained up? Uh, me. Uh, me. Uh, <laughs> the last three seconds did not go according to plan. I was gonna ask, is he a, a Saiyan? Who is Master Roshi? Is he just a human that knows how to Kamehameha? Because he is the strongest, like, is he the strongest human? Is there a lot I don't know about Master Roshi? Huh. Inform me about Master Roshi. I need to know now. Fiddlesticks. I never thought about I that. I could have sworn he was the strongest fighter in the world. Oh, right. The 300-year-old man. Seriously, why is she chained up? Roshi's not even in the top five anymore. As in, I've got at least five friends all stronger than he is. Is that so? Oh, do not indulge him. Okay, who else keeps talking? Hello. The brain. Um, hi. My name is Dr. Wheelow. Good to meet you. Wait, Dr. Jonathan Wheelow? The famous biologist and cancer researcher? Your breakthroughs changed the entire landscape of the field. Oh, thank you, thank you. Can I have your body? What? No! Oh, I'm so sorry. Not sexually. I, I mean your actual physical body. To put my brain in. Still no! Oh, come on. It's been 50 years. I suddenly got sick one day, lung cancer, ironically, and that one decides to put me in stasis. Next thing I know, he's gone to get groceries for 50 years, which is just my father all over again. Okay, well, I'm sorry and all, but there's no way I'd agree to that. Not that you'd fit, anyway. Why? Oh, your great matter seems to have absorbed a little bit of the embalming fluid that you're stored in. What? How big am I? I'd say... A golden retriever. But a golden retriever's brain is small. No, like the yes, size of a golden retriever. Don't you what the hell, man? Oh, calm down, sir. I can't fit in a body like this. Don't worry about it. Sometimes brain surgery is a little more art than science. You're thinking of baking. I might be thinking of baking. Well, Pinky, you picked the wrong guy anyway. You want Son Goku. Can I fit in him? To be fair, there's probably a vacancy. But you have to get him here first, and good <laughs> yeah. luck kidnap- Yeah, I mean, there might be- might be a golden retriever size vacancy inside Goku, you're right. Bing. What is that? Hello? My name is Son Goku. Is anyone home? Oh, when the stars align. Someone made a mistake! If you're looking for the world's strongest fighter, I'm here! Yes, yes, Son Goku! Please, if you would, join us! I... Sure hope it's warmer inside. It's actually colder! How is it colder? <laughs> Why do I feel like Luffy and Goku have like the same exact personality? I think... L Luffy... Is... I don't, I don't know if he's technically smarter. Luffy also does a lot of stupid things. But they're also like very strong, goofy fighters. I wonder if that's, I wonder if that's uh, the reason why the shows are popular. I wonder if that's like a thing, you know, like a uh, a recipe for anime, if you will. 
Oh, cool. He's got a ball pit. Oh, no, he's got a ball pit. Coaching? Yes? What? Oh, the Death Spheres! Quite ingenious, no? No! Why do we have them? Well, if the Red Ribbon Army hadn't suddenly up and disappeared, they'd have made us a mint! And there goes 50 billion zip. No much! That was easily the second worst ball pit I've ever been in. Oh no, oh god, ew, 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 it's moist. Why is it moist? Okay, get it together. Just gotta go in there and do it. Just like with Chi Chi. Just like with Chi Chi. Oh no. Good, good. He's already dispatched of one of the bio. What do you mean, just like with Chi Chi? What have you done to Chi Chi? There he is. Hoblop. He was made for hugs. And combat. No. I swear, I'ma deck the heck out of the next guy I see. <laughs> oh, oh, shit. Oh, oh, gosh, I'm sorry. What the f man? D do you need some ice? Oh, you think you're funny? Zaps, get in here. I, I need a sec. I'm the electrocutioner now. No, don't electrocutionate him. I don't give a f Who's your buddy? Dude, did you see the size of Goku's mouth? I don't give a f Who's your buddy? Dude. I understand it's anime. But look at those chompers. Oh my god. They look like a titan. Wait, can they all talk? Of course they can. They're completely sentient. I need a hug. With all their own wants and needs, and a crippling fear of death. So dark. And cold. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. Now, Freezer! Preserve the goods! Wait, uh, Freezer? Why does that sound familiar? Oh, God, it's like the worst part of getting into a pool! That's a thousand! Lay the finishing blow! Go hard! Thank goodness, Piccolo's here! Oh, hey, son. Hold tight, Dad! We've got you! We? I was gonna say that is one of the coolest intros or things I've ever seen Krillin do. But it lasted a whole 0.5 seconds. <sighs> Kaioken. <laughs> Man, your new body is gonna be wicked! Who did- is that Piccolo? Completely destroyed the bio warriors. I just thought of something. Coachin, why didn't you give me one of their bodies? Uh, hmm, I guess you're right. See, this is why you're the brains. <laughs> what, too cheesy? More insensitive. Oh, grow some thicker skin. I thought it was clever. I thought it was funny too. <sighs> Hurry guys! We're almost there! So cold! Still wet! Frostbite! So much frostbite! I don't know why they like why they're cold, alright? Like I understand it's freezing, but I'm assuming if you have some kind of like energy and power you possess in the inside, that you can uh, like alleviate like a little bit to like and it causes heat, right? So I'm assuming that these lasers do damage because they're really hot lasers, you know? So just like zzz. Don't worry, Krillin. The cold never killed anyone. Hypothermia would beg to differ. Why don't you turn out the lights? To give us an air of menace. Why do we need menace? Here he comes. Wow, this place sure is menacing. Goku! Bulma! Don't worry, Bulma. I'll get you out of here. Daddy! Uh, 
I'm gonna have nerve damage after today. Hey, why didn't you warn me? I didn't know what would happen. I haven't tried to break out. Well, why not? I'm chained here. Well, that's sexy. You mean sexist? Well, it's a little sexy. <laughs> oh my goodness. Is that a brain? Why is it the size of a greyhound? The bus? This is the magnificent Dr. Willow, and we'd like to welcome you to our evil lair. This is neither a lair, nor is it evil. This is a laboratory for science! Yes, for evil science. No, no regular no science. science at worst. I don't care what kind of science you're cooking up. I'm here for two things. To rescue my friends and correct a mistake. I am Son Goku, and I am the world's strongest. Okay, we believe you. Good. Then if you don't mind, I'm gonna just grab my friends and be on my way. What right, is this red before the fall, eh, Dad? Come on, Gohan! It's two against... Huh. Three! Three against one! <laughs> Mr. Piccolo! Wait, how long have we had him? About a week. Just give me his body! Can't! No penis! Why do you know that? Yo, I broke out of the thingy. Oh, hey, Piccolo! Wow, your eyes are red! Yes, You've been hanging no around penis. Master Roshi. Mr. Piccolo! <laughs> Don't you dare hit my son! Unless you're training right now. In which case, Gohan, get back up. Dad, I think Dr. Willow's controlling him. Well, I am a brain in a jar. So you admit it. Coach, you please explain. Kill them all! Why? <laughs> Atrocities. Excuse you, Mustard Gas would like a word. Uh, excuse you, Solar Energy has something to say. Excuse you, Anthrax has an opinion on that. Excuse you, Penicillin would like to chime in. The Atom Bomb. Ah! Coaching, stop antagonizing him! You're right, he's incredibly strong. In fact, Coachin, he is a child with no. a penis. Oh my Coachin, God, please! Dude. You're right. I should check. <laughs> Insolent boy, he is in for such a caning. <laughs> Not so tough without your cane. Huh? Isn't Gohan like one of the strongest characters in the show? Right? Isn't that isn't that thing? For some reason, I remember that being a thing, and then he he became like a superhero that like didn't use powers, something like that, right? Old oh, man. <laughs> um. Oh. <laughs> what about the launch? Yes. And that's for ruining my Sunday. Uh, uh -huh. Oh, oh, back to normal. Fifty years I was alone. And when I am finally saved from that loneliness, all I find is horror. In this form, I am powerless, doomed to witness these atrocities. I need a body. I will have a body! <laughs> For some reason, <laughs> I mean, for obvious reasons, I thought he was actually a good guy for a second. I'm like, oh, it's, it, he is the he's the cancer guy, and he's fine, and Bulba kind of likes him a little bit, and he doesn't really want to be in a body. See, so he, he's kind of. I'm like, oh wait, that's right, it's an abridged series. I wonder if I had this. Wait, you seriously never noticed the exo body I left for you? 
Did you think I'd literally just leave you in a jar? What kind of monster do you think I am? Fair enough! Jeez. See? Now you got a body. This is not a body! This can't taste or smell or touch! I am a brain trapped in an exoskeleton! Well, when you think about it, aren't we all just... No! A come in, a hop in, a send him home to mommy! Ka oh, that's cute. Ka ah! Krillin, you better not have to eat that! Yeah, it might have been me. Wait. Bulma spray. Just grab Bulma and fly away. Can you take me home? Yeah. All right, everyone. Stand oh, back. Perfect timing. I'm a Kaio Kenneth. <laughs> that means you too, Gohan. Kaio Ken Kite Spray! Kaio Again, time three and a half. Don't oh, mind the sweater. Ruben. Wow, that was quicker than expected. Nah, he's alive up there, plotting like the evil scientist he is. Look at this planet. So beautiful. I'll never see it with my own <laughs> eyes again. They really didn't kill him, he just sent him into space. <laughs> That's kind of funny. Someone needs to kill him. And by someone, I mean the Earth. Wait, this doesn't seem right. Yeah, kill him, Goku! I'll be right back. Yeah, kill him, Gohan! <laughs> Hey, Dr. Weevil! I... Wait, are you crying? I physically can't, but I'm just so sad! You're not really evil at all, are you? No! I just want a body! Fifty years alone, trapped! <laughs> Can you wait one more? I mean, I guess. <laughs> All right, ready to kill him. Dad, no, we worked it out. He's not evil. Oh, well, I can't just. Did Krillin just really disrespect Gohan by like flying up there to try to hurt the dude as Gohan's like talking to him? Turn this off. Maybe if I just set it down. Good work, team. Did they do not use the Dragon Balls? I am the Eternal Dragon. State your... <sighs> okay, who died? Actually, nobody. In fact, we want you to create a whole new body. I'm listening. We want you to make a human body and put that brain inside of it. Huh. Well, at least it's better than that last wish. Who summons the Eternal Dragon to melt some ice? Hmm. Your wish is granted. Thank you, everyone. What? Now I can live a oh normal life my again. my god. There is no way that's real. There's no way. Right, all right, so let me know if that's the actual wish. If they wasted another wish on one person. There's so many other things you could fix. They're coaching and the brain. Yes, coaching and the brain. Each is a genius, but one is insane. Their lair is girt by ice. Their ambition's not nice. They're coaching, they're coaching, and the brain, 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 brain. 
They're making plans to steal the world's strongest guy by the ending of this spiel. One of them may just die. They're coaching and the brain. It's coaching and the brain. I. This was the most interesting 30 minutes. Because this, like. Hey, let's the science something. seems arcane and the practice inhumane. A day new body lies in Son Goku's demise. They're coaching. They're coaching and the brain, 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 brain. Yeah! Hey guys, Masako X here. I. This has been the. Like, alright. So I'm not the hugest fan of that movie. Episode, but it was like. It was very normal. It was almost like in between both of a bridge series and the actual show for like the content wise. You know, I didn't think it was as funny as it usually is. I'm trying to get the red in here a little bit. It's, it's, it's all right. But now we're caught up. So next week we're gonna start the Frieza movie. Actually, well, I guess we're just gonna do, I'll probably just do all of them in one for you guys, right? Cause we want that. You guys would like that. Well, if you want that, like the video. I'm gonna do it anyway, but if, if you can like the video, that'd be it'd be really nice as well. Otherwise, have a fantastic day. Uh, subscribe to Mattables for more reaction content. See ya.